Faye Ellington here, back with you again. This time I want to talk about the cure for whooping cough. That was a hacking cough, you know. And man, when you hear somebody who have whooping cough cough, you, you, you feel it for them and they, they feel it. They kind of bend over and stuff. Anyway, I don't know if you know about a cane piece. And let me just deal, use this also. So a cane piece, a piece of land where a cane is planted coffee piece, a piece of land where coffee is planted, ginger piece, a piece of land where ginger is planted, I go on and on like that. So, peace. Well, do you say have mangoes in a cane piece? Mm -hmm. And we have rat in a cane piece. Mm. And then if you go on to your history now, you'll find out which was there first, the rat or the mangoes. <laughs> anyway, this is not what this is about. Whooping cough is what it's about. Jamaicans have some interesting remedies, you know. This one now was, if you have whooping cough, you should boil cane piece rat soup. Yes. I've never had it. I hear it works. My mother used to tease me as a child because she is a great, she is a great tease still at 95. And my cousin and I, Errol, she would tease us when we have a cough that she's going to boil cane piece rat soup and give it to us. It would have been more like a broth, you know, and give it to us. Not with the, oh Christ, am I saying this? Not with the meat in it. But then again, um, different people eat different things in different cultures, you know what I mean? But that one used to get to me when I hear people talk about it. But I gather people used to do it. They find a rat in the cane piece and they boil it and they give the soup to whomever it was who was having this whooping cough, this racking cough. Well, kind of glad that wasn't offered to my mother for my asthma. Them the days I only used to wheeze and never used to cough. So I'm throwing out these things, asking you to comment. Have you ever heard about it, the cane piece rat soup? And um, have you ever used it? Anybody ever give it to you or tell you about it when you have a hacking cough? Usually then they call it whooping cough. Faye Ellington here, just bringing the culture to you, right? Um, not that you should go out there and find a cane piece wrapped and uh, make some soup, but just so you know what used to be, maybe still is.